Huge news just dropped about the future of Call of Duty. Microsoft is making a game-changing move, and I'm here to break it down for you. According to a new report from the Wall Street Journal, Microsoft are soon to announce that the new Call of Duty, Black Ops 6, will be available on Games Pass on launch. This big reveal is expected to happen during the Xbox Game Showcase later next month. This marks a major shift from Microsoft's video game sales strategy as they move away from traditional sales. Xbox's president Sarah Bond recently suggested that all Microsoft-owned games, including the ones acquired such as Activision, will be on Game Pass. This aligns with Xbox boss Phil Spencer's vision for the future of gaming. Typically, a new Call of Duty game sells for $75 and can move up to 25 million copies, generating a serious amount of revenue. I'm talking hundreds of millions in revenue. By releasing the game on Game Pass, Microsoft hoped to boost subscription sales However, risk cannibalizing traditional sales. Microsoft argues that Game Pass can actually boost sales by increasing exposure for the games. However, some publishers remain skeptical, including the previous Activision CEO. Unlike Microsoft, Sony doesn't launch its new exclusives into the subscription service. They actually prefer traditional sales. Industry analysts will be watching this one very, very closely. They want to see if this move affects the entire gaming industry. Could this become the new standard for game launches? This year's Call of Duty is targeted at a late October release. There's also rumors that Microsoft might release the entire back catalog of Call of Duty games onto Game Pass before Black Ops 6 is released. These additions could create a huge boost for Game Pass subscriptions, especially as Microsoft faced pressure to grow its subscriber base. Are you excited for Call of Duty launching on the Game Pass? Let me know your thoughts about it in the comments down below. Thanks for watching, subscribe, and see you in the next one. Bye-bye.